Over the past several months, businesses have been trying to rebound from the November 24th riots in Ferguson. Some have closed good for, for good, but others, such as the Fashion Art Boutique, with the help of STL Together, have bounced back in a major way. The city of Ferguson has taken blows over the past several months and is still in the process of recovery. One business owner took the time out to talk to me about the long road back. It was very good. Uh, I think that uh, we made very good progress and I felt that it took a long time, but most people said they thought they did it. Uh, we did it in a short time. Morris gave me a flashback of the night her store burned down and her feelings afterwards. Devastating. It's something where you done work so hard and put a lot of love and a lot of attention and money in it, and all of a sudden, it's just gone. It's, it's devastating. One employee talked about how close-knit they were able to remain since the store's recovery. Um, we are more like family instead of like employee. We just work, we have fun together. It's just an easy job, because I do what I do. <laughs> Customers to the store spoke about what attracted them to the boutique. The drawing card for me was the window display. Uh, the very colorful uh, hats and purses and shoes caught my eye right off the bat. Juanita is excited about the reopening of her store and remains optimistic about the plans moving forward. The boutique is back in full swing and in a brand new location. The new store is at 10990 New Halls Ferry Road at the crossing at Halls Ferry. For LUTV News, I'm Andrew Wofford.